hard-fought victory over those who tried to tear us apart, the tragedy of Windhelm crushed our hope. Fear led some people to pursue mad schemes. We couldn't let them die in the frozen wasteland. We did what was necessary to keep us all together. I think we actually went a bit over the top, but whatever. We won't comment on that. Right. Onward. How many days do we have until the big freeze? I have absolutely no idea. Please say that's going to build that before the these things come back. No, it's not. Right. That's on raw food. I'm going to cancel that and put that on raw food as well. Otherwise, we're going to waste all of this stuff that we're bringing in. You can turn off. <laughs> that is so many flying hunters going back in. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> I didn't realise how many we have. <laughs> That's a lot. Wow, we can turn the heating off for you. Uh, I don't dare turn these things off. I don't dare turn them off. In case it messes with the objective. It's fine, we can handle it. Yeah, that's still going up. That's fine. It's fine. You are processing as fast as you can, which is absolutely fine and dandy. I know the wood that we're having trouble with at the moment, but there's not really a way we can get more of it. Outpost! Awesome. I don't know what we would need most of. It might actually do work. <gasps> hell yes! 50% faster. Oh, hell yeah. We are doing that. That's well worth it. Again, medical-wise, we're, we're doing fine. We are doing fine and dandy. You have reached test the city. Oh, can we not enter it because we decided not to on the first? Oh, that was a thing. I had no idea that was a thing. Oh, that's frustrating. Oh, well. Knowing my luck, they would have died anyway and with a bunch of resources on them, so. Yeah, I'm not too, I'm not too bothered about it. Really not. Uh, what was that? Oh, it's that. It's finished. Outpost team. 150 wood every... Is that it? That's not very much, is it? Well, that's a pathetic outpost. What was the point of doing that? Right, well, I'll save the bloody resources. That was a waste of time. I didn't realise it was so crap. <laughs> nice. They are now going to shift these to be faster. We might as well do this. We might as well do it. Right, I want to read what this thing does. Oh my god, what is that? That does not look productive. <laughs> Protector of the truth. Captain's word. Use. Each use greatly reduced the discontent. Discontent. The captain will assume the title Protector of the Truth. He will be the only one who can tell us what is right and wrong. I, I thought... See, I thought my brain just inserted a line of text there, but I realised that my brain read ahead faster than my eyes were. <laughs> be the only one who can tell us what is right and what is wrong, and so guide our fate. The problem is, though... I'm the captain, aren't I? I bloody well hope I am. <laughs> I really, really hope I am. Oh, well, I can't see anything else being useful, to be honest with you. So, I really, we don't need anything else. So, what's the worst that can happen? Probably loads, but what's the worst that can happen? Maybe I've... Maybe I've gone through every, like, I've gone through the bad stages, so I'm actually now getting the positivity out of stuff. Huh. Maybe that's a thing. I... Gen maybe that's a thing. I've, maybe I've avoided the faith keepers and, like, that line so much that I never got to the end game part of it. I'm actually really interested to see what that end thing there is. Oh no, I don't even have to read that to know what that is. I don't even have to read it to know what that does. 
Oh my god, I would have become like a bloody deity or something. With the introduction of new faith, all who voice doubts will be branded enemies of the faith. Oh my god. Everyone must be devoted to the survival of our cause, all who do not want be swept aside. Shit. I will no more never be a problem again. The Londoners will have to renounce their views. A public execution space will be built. Jeez. Some Londoners will die. Well, they don't exist anymore, so that's not an issue. Some people will be felt will feel compelled to fight this law, such as them. Okay. Okay. Let's just edge slowly away from that and uh, continue with our normal lives. We started on day 27. <laughs> Go to day 31, shall we? <laughs> Let's just ignore every single part of what we just read. That sounds like a good plan to me. They're about to arrive back at the city. Wonderful. <laughs> yeah. Let's. I know I said I'd never do faith keepers because they would cause problems, but I kind of got forced into doing them. I'm going to avoid everything and anything that forces me in that direction because that for love nor money is not happening <laughs> ever you have to always remember also this is a new home this is the first like level of this game i think there's like four or five dlcs or something for this game as well so needless to say once we get to the end of this i'm gonna be playing through them because Frostpunk 2 has not come out yet. And that is the reason I started playing this game again. To wait for that game. I also, by the way, I um, I have recorded a first episode of uh, A Plague Tales Innocence. Because I want to play the second game, but I can't remember what happened in the first game. So I want to replay the first game. I have recorded a first episode. It is edited and uploaded. I just haven't made it public. So... If that's something you want to see, let me know down in the comments because that video is ready to go. I just haven't made it public. Don't ask me why, I just haven't made it public. Um, that's gonna, Surely that's going to be like a wood outpost. That's two days as well. Jeez. Ah, screw it. What else are they going to do? That's going to be an outpost. Or we'll lead on to something else that I don't care about. That's an outpost that I don't care about. Let's just go. Let's just go. Can't believe it's two days and eleven hours, and that's fifty percent cut down. <gasps> that's a lot. Right, we've only got one day left on this. That'll be perfect. We'll be able to start stockpiling coal once more. Awesome. Right, let's carry on building our houses. Let's build away, peeps. Build away. Build away. Build away. Oh, they won't start building until eight a.m. Will they? My bad. Unexpected guests. Oh! Captain, a group of exhausted survivors have reached our cities from their frantic explanations. We know they've come a great distance and many of them have died along the way. The phrase doom is coming. <gasps> it's the storm! It keeps being repeated and they say many more refugees are following them. They're begging us to help them. Yeah, let's do it. We've got loads of resources. Let's go. Okay, so we've got to build. We've got to build. Um, how do I, how do I see how much oh, spare, oh, those can turn back on. Oh, if you ever heard any neighbours talking about hoarding food. Wonderful. Go and grab it. Uh, right. They're going to be there. Trip load after some stolen supplies. Beautiful. Wood and food. Ooh, hello. Frozen supplies, with moderate effort we were able to remove the crates containing supplies from under the snow and put them to good use in our city. Wonderful. Right. Um, so there, I guess. Okay, so if they're coming in that direction, we're going to lose access to these first, right? In theory. Right, so I want to build more of these giant resource beacons. It's the wood that's killing me. I don't know how to make more wood. I don't want to use the coal thing to do it, but... 
Oh, if we never upgraded that. Oh, for goodness sake. I'm an idiot. Good job, buddy. Really, really good job. Nice one. You're a genius. <laughs> right. What does this give us access to? Boosted scout guns. Oh, my God. 100% faster. Hell, yeah. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. What else does it give us access to? Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Generator safety bypass. That doesn't sound dangerous at all. Coal sun projectors. Oh, we don't need to go down that route because we skipped it. Advanced wall drill. 200 per day. 160 for 200. That is not worth it. I'm not even sure the steam wall drill was worth it. <laughs> yeah. No, that's not worth it. Uh, and in here, I suppose we could do that. We're definitely going to need the insulation when it gets freezing, freezing, freezing cold. And then I might just, I, uh, I don't know. I don't think we'll, I genuinely don't think we'll need it. I genuinely don't think we're going to need it. Do you want to expand two questions? Wow. That was a huge ass game. Holy crap. <laughs> I didn't expect it to be quite that big. Yes, that is what you said. Um, I guess we build more houses then. Build another road. Build another road. Oh, you've arrived. New landmark. The search hasn't uncovered anything of value, but we may be able to reach some promising new locations. So. What? We may be able to. You literally haven't uncovered anything, though. What was the point of that? <laughs> uh, how long did that take you? Two days and 16 hours. Oh, my God. Right, sorry. Just go over there. Whatever. Just go. <laughs> Just go. God, we are literally turning into steampunk. The amount of smoke that's coming off this city now. Jeez. Three hours left. Right, that's perfect, even though our... <laughs> We don't even need any more because our hope is maxed out. <sighs> oh, I think I might actually get. I think I might actually have got the hang of this game. <laughs> I'm actually. I'm, I'm looking forward to the uh, to the other game modes now because if I remember rightly, some of them are actually more difficult. <laughs> Plus, we could always uh, if we if we. I don't know that Frostpunk 2 is coming out this year. So if our other game modes take us into next year and it's still not out once we get through all of them. <laughs> it hasn't moved. <laughs> it hasn't moved. Oh my god. The only thing we're going to do is, yeah, there's a low risk anyway, so let's just, okay, so we'll just keep the heaters on for to stop the moderate risk of getting it problem solved. And we don't even need it because there's... That's that's cool. That's cool. We have more capacity on health work on healthcare than we actually need. What country can say that? <laughs> Damn son. We done good. <laughs> oh, that is just that, that yeah. That is just not happening. What I can do though is I can do the expanded shift now, but because the sod it, do it. There's only three of them, but whatever. What we do know though, what we do need though, is the, uh, the trees. That's chilly. I might have to expand that. Oh, here we go, ladies and gents. Here we go. Running from the storm, a huge crowd of people have reached the city. Many of them are sick. They say they have some kind of enormous weather anomaly is coming our way, and they'll they'll die without our help. We'd never su we'd never have survived it. Thank our lucky stars that uh, Pollux Spore warned us about the disaster and told us to evacuate. Please let us in. Yep, come on in. We are building houses for you as we speak. That, actually, saying that, that's going to be worth it. Because we're really struggling on making wood. Oh, do we need to make processors? Yeah, not 
sure I can do that. There's still bunk houses, but that's fine because they get worn by that, so that's not an issue. We still need five more houses. Jeez. I might actually wait till that research is done. What happened to our house only costing? <laughs> the hell? <laughs> Oh, is it just taking resources? Aye. Okay, probably an outpost here years ago, but there's nothing left now but a frozen sawmill. Right oh. Oh, there's more. Stone ship. Is anything standing out in the endless white desert? You love that line, don't you? <laughs> a box like vehicle, like sticking out of snow. Hmm. Surely no one would have survived that. A wrecked vehicle. You can't keep vehicle form out there, surely. I think I might start going down the route. I might just start going down the route. Nah, I can't do that because we're gonna... Nah. They're all chilly and I can't make them... I'm not gonna have enough resources to make them livable. Sorry, birdie. We don't need it anyway. <laughs> right, so we just need two more houses and then we're good. He says there's another, like, 60 people are coming in. We're gonna have to build more houses. We are gonna have to build more houses. And I have no way of getting more wood. Oh bugger. This could be getting problematic. Maybe. After all, that outpost would have been worth it. Oh well. Done it now. While dismantling the wreck to salvage what we could from it, we found a hidden cache of supplies. Nice! Damage snow at all. Let's go after that! Does it say movement? <laughs> Great vehicle, possibly by an explosion. There's parts scattered all around it. Ah! Huh. Let's go have a look-see then. Damn, we're already on day 31. We absolutely smashed through those first days, through those few days. That's crazy as hell. And people are starving. Whoops. <laughs> oh my god, there's so many people coming. <laughs> I can't build houses fast enough. <laughs> Found some supplies inside the wreck. Surely we'll find a good use. Nice. Right. Head on to the stone ship and then head back. Because we need the metric arse ton of wood that you're carrying. You know what? I'm going to make another... Um, and I can't because I don't have enough wood. <laughs> okay. Right. Yeah, come on. Get your ass in here. More than enough workers. We can use it for waypoint and further exploration. Okay. So there's literally nothing here. After all that. Right. Get your asses. Oh. Let's go. We need to make a lot of stuff. <laughs> oh, that's what you could be researching. No, you can't because it's already maxed out. <laughs> okay, just research those then. <laughs> Let's do that. I'm trying to build houses as fast as I possibly can. But I don't have the resources to do it. I'm sorry. I'm trying. <laughs> All right. Max out on raw food. And there's more houses. Poking around some trees marked with crosses we found a shallow grave. Shallow graves under each of them. Dead bodies lack most of the bigger muscles and some of the bones. Yep, just do it as respectfully as you can. Let's go to the coal mine and then you're coming home too because there's nothing you can do out there. There's nothing left out there for you to do. Nice one. Medics are working overtime. That's fine. Might actually be worth putting down another infirmary if we can afford to do it, which we can't. <laughs> 30 wood, okay. We can do that when, it, when the uh, guys come back. Yeah, let's go for it. 
I'm not going to do it. I'm not actually going to do it. But it's just there. Because I want to get the, I want to get the extended work day. I'm not going to use the 24 hour. Don't worry. Do not fret. He says. As he's literally about. Oh no we don't do it. We don't need it. The wood's coming back. We don't need it. I was about to do a 24 hour on the, on the sawmill. <laughs> on the water I should say. We don't need it. We do not need it. A new workday starts today on the farm. Yep, let them on in. Oh dear. Oh, it's coming from that direction. Oh, I'm glad we did all those then. Why were they coming? Okay, I'm not going to question it. Not going to question it. <laughs> oh, okay. Then new. What do we have to build? Oh. It's a long sword. Damn. They're going to be done almost identically. Wowza. Okay. Just do it because whatever it is, I'm sure we actually need it. No. We lost some of the wood because we don't have space. Oh, God damn it all to hell. Balls. Well, that is not good. No. Didn't want to do that. Right. Go off and find out what those are. And we are slowly retrieving all of the supplies that the Londoners uh, hoarded. In addition to Jesus Christ. <laughs> In addition to solving a lot of medical issues. Bloody Nora. We might have to build another one. I'm going to put a heater there anyway, so that makes sense. I'm going to have to put one a heater there eventually, so it makes sense to go there. And we are nearly maxed out on coal. Nice. Well, ladies and gents, I have absolutely smashed through my uh, target of day 31. And we are in a damn good situation for the upcoming massive storm. Um, we've actually managed to build enough houses for all our residencies annoyingly when the uh, wood came back we lost probably about 150 maybe 200 of it because we didn't have enough storage space but that's fine we are going to make some more storage space actually can we make some more storage space no but we're very close to it awesome so we'll make some more large storage spaces for the food which i'm going to do in food rations rather than raw food because when the weather comes we won't be able to use our kitchens so that will be all ready to rock and roll i think it comes by about day 40 but once we've researched this uh, lens and we'll get more information about the storm anyway as always ladies and gentlemen thank you very much for watching thank you very much for your support and i'll see you in the next one